Good morning. So what we've got here is just a regular basic figure eight descender. Uh, they're small, they're compact, they're lightweight. This one's about three and a half, four inches long. Um, the rope installs in this figure eight just like it does a rescue eight or a Q side eight with ears. Um, we'll do a demonstration on how to repel this particular eight and perform a soft lock. What we're going to show you now is how to install a figure eight on the rope. This is just a simple eight. It's got no hyper horns, no rescue ears. Um, but that doesn't matter because all of the figure eights, whether it's one with rescue ears or the hyper horns on it, the installation is going to be the same. Take a bite of rope, put it through the large eye, bring it down. And you're creating a girth hitch. Take your carabiner. So I'm right handed, so with all of the family of eight devices, you want the falling end of the rope to be on the right side of the device, like it is here if you're right handed. If you were left handed, you'd have it installed. So this was on the left hand side of the device. So we've got the eight, we're ready to descend. I'm right-handed, my right hand is down here at my brake. Um, one thing I'd like to say, this is just a demonstration, where are you really gonna repel with this type of device? You'd have a prussic backup, either above the device or below it, or be working a two rope system where you're belayed. So again, when I'm ready to come down, I just release a little bit of pressure on my right hand. If I wanna stop, I just apply pressure. If I want to do a soft lock with this eight, maybe not, there we go. Now I've got what we call a soft lock. If you look, it'll creep on me still. That's why it's a soft lock. I want to make a hard lock, pass a bite of rope through the device, two half hitches above. Now I can do whatever it is I need to do hands-free. When I'm ready to come down. Pop it out. What I want to do is show you the proper way to install a rappel system. Um, particularly with your figure of eight family. So we'll install the rope as per normal. Now we want to have, particularly in tree work, we climb, even if it's double rope technique, we climb on single rope systems. So we don't have the benefit of a redundant rope backup. So when you're on rappel, proper procedure is to back up your device with the prussic. And you can do it above or below. What I prefer is above. So now, This repel device is backed up with this prusik, and I'll show you how it works on repel. So now, I'm on repel with our backup prusik. So as I come down, I dress the prusik. If something were to go awry, the prusik sits. If I hit something, knock myself unconscious, panic on repel, what I'm gonna do is let go of that prusik. 